Natalis action is a good way to um, do repetitive tasks really quickly. Like they say, you want to convert uh, to MP3s to uh, you know iPod or um, whatever it is, right? Now, if you know the the terminal command line for those, then it'll be easy for you. Yeah, even if you don't know it, there's still websites that you can download some of these from, so it's still good, right? <clears throat> but it's you know more beneficial to you is if you know the terminal, okay? So if you don't have it by uh, default, you can always use the Synaptic to install it. Um, Natalis Action, that's the one, right? And install that bitch. And when you open it, you see um, this in your menu somewhere. Now I meant to give you some by default, and some of them I imported, right? Uh, like let's say this one um, open as root. That reminds me of the GK suit Natalis, right? Which is the command that they use, see? And you can also set parameters to it. Um, see the legends here that you can use some parameters that they have, okay? Now they have conditions and uh, advanced conditions, but um, <coughs> let's say uh, these other ones like uh, merge PDFs, right? So that means it only affect PDF files, right? So you see um, in the conditions, see it says only PDF files. See, uh, same thing with other ones like uh, this one up here, convert uh, GIF to PNG, right? So it's only gonna affect GIF files. So this is what I mean. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, you have a folder here, right? And this folder contains uh, different shits like uh, JPEG, PDF, GIF, and a folder, right? Now on this one, uh, the GIF, right? Let's say uh, you um, right-click on it and uh, you see the menu, right? Now you see it has a convert to PNG here, right? But it doesn't say anything else um, besides that, okay? If you want to uh, convert to PNG, uh, let's say you want to go here with the PDF, and let's see if you have that same options or not. See, there is no convert to PNG. Okay, it's only merge PDF. That's all it has. Okay, so uh, like I said, uh, different file types uh, have different uh, options. Okay, like in the folders, right? I click on it, and you see it says open as root. It doesn't have any PDF or any other shits. So it's not gonna clutter your um, menu because your menu is usually like this right and it has all this only see yeah, and you won't see the other shits unless you click on that specific file format see so that's why the conditions um, in your um, Natalis action here your conditions right is what sets uh, it apart from uh, other stuff and you also your parameters Okay, that makes it um, less clutter, clutter on your menu. Okay. <coughs> now, um, like I said, you you can uh, do this if you, you know the terminal. If you don't know it, then you can always use uh, this website here. They have a few that you can download. Uh, like let's say this 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 one right here, convert to uh, 3PG. And all you really gotta do is um, download the configuration files, right? This uh, sch schema, that's what it's called. And they also say, you know, what dependencies that you need, like FFmpeg. And these are the ones that you install from the Synaptic or sudo install it. And uh, all you gotta do is uh, really import it in after you uh, download it. Let's say you uh, see all these ones I download, okay? All you gotta do is uh, import it from your um, Natalis action, and you know, find the fucking file and, and import it, and just click OK, and you're done. That's that's really all you gotta do to import it. So uh, that's what it uh, it does. You know, it does uh, shits quickly um, from your right-click menu, and like I said, if you know the terminal, it'll help you out more. If you don't, just use that website. I'll post a link on that and the side for that. And that's it.